gör man det nog bara. Ja, jag gör det. Okej. Okay. Are you coming? Are you coming to Christ? Oh, yes. Are you? Good evening, we're here with Sharks TV with uh, head coach Martin Grubb after a 3-2 loss, unfortunately, to the Telford Tigers. Martin, many people say you always look immaculate in your interviews and uh, speaking to somebody earlier, they really wanted to know, where do you get your suits from? Uh, the internet. In, in, in any particular sites are we not allowed to advertise on, on Solway Sharks TV? Hey, I don't know if I'm allowed to advertise. Or actually, I, I just wear the suits that I'm told to wear. No, the good lady, she she p picks the suits, and I just do what I'm told. Us. So they're not like club bought suits. Unfortunately, no, no. What about, what about the tie? The tie uh, is mine as well. Yeah, no, fantastic. Tie. I actually uh, prepared mm -hmm. some questions this week to ask you because I always think you know you do these interviews at the end of every game, and it's kind of like one of those ones where you know you shrug your shoulders a bit and you say where you've been a bit complacent and where you were good. But I thought I'm going to ask you about uh, some different questions okay. this week. Okay. I asked James Hutchinson who he would want to fight the most out of the team and he said uh, Conor Henderson and Dan Abercrombie. I'm going to turn it around a bit and if you could let any of the team punch you, who would, who would you let punch you and why? Probably Daniel Abercrombie because it would probably hurt him more than it hurt me. He's made of chocolate so if he, me, uh, if he hit me it would probably hurt him more. Dan seems to be a, a popular option for these questions. Uh, who was your favourite Power Ranger? I actually am a little bit old for the Power Rangers. Oh, uh, uh, my son's quite into them and you know, I, I think there's a blue Power Ranger, so... We'll change it. Who was your favourite Spice Girl? Um, scary at the time. I'd like to switch up a wee bit. Any particular reason? Just a wee bit different. Everybody was going, you know, Jerry had for uh, obvious reasons and Baby for obvious reasons, so uh, you know, I went, went a bit scary. Fantastic. Uh, what is your favourite kind of biscuit? It's a tough one, very tough one, because I'm partial to a biscuit. Um, I really like a caramel wafer, a classic, or a chocolate digestive. Chocolate digestive, good choice. Uh, where are we? Uh, if you could be someone else, who would you want to be and why? I don't know. That's a very good question. Thank you. Um, maybe you. Just so I can stand here and, and try and embarrass everybody else. And it. Yeah, cool. That's fair enough. Uh, I asked uh, James Hutchinson this as well, but I'd be interested to know your answer. If you had a lot of money, or if you won the lottery, and you bought a yacht, what would you call it? Dignity. Okay, fair enough. Um, this one, I, I wasn't sure if Struan Tonner, the captain of the Solway Sharks, was going to be here getting interviewed, so I wrote this one for him, but I'll ask you. Have you ever started a fight and then ran away? Yes, I played and I grew up in junior hockey with Scott Plews and my team, <laughs> so I used to deliberately start fights in his orders and run away so he could finish them. But I understand why you don't want to ask Stuart that. Hi Scott, if you're watching. It's, uh, it's, it's been a while. Yeah. Okay, I also gave James the opportunity to ask me any questions. Uh, is there anything you would like to ask me, Martin? I'd just like to think, uh, what is the first thing that goes through your head when you wake up every day? I better check Facebook and Snapchat. It's fair enough. Probably the same as me. Yeah. Uh, is that the first? I would probably say that's one of the first things anyway. Yeah. And uh, mm. the only other question I really have is, what do you think of Duncan Spears Jr.? Duncan Spears Jr., a man of many, many words. Uh, he can't drink uh, alcohol uh, to save himself. He, d he never shuts up. He's really difficult to get a word in edgeways with Dunk. Uh, and I much prefer his dad and his brother. Better beard. Much better beard. Well, thanks very much, Martin, for your time. And uh, good luck in the playoffs. And uh, that's been Martin Grubb, head coach of the Solway Sharks.